Today is my first uh, post-workout day. As you guys saw, yesterday I did chest. It's been almost half a year since I've been into a gym. Yesterday was my chest day and triceps day, but you guys only saw me do uh, a bench press. And even though I started working out at one o'clock at night, because obviously at night nobody's going to be in the gym, so I can make the videos for you. Not to mention that I am a big fan of just being in there all by myself, just doing my thing and not have to worry about somebody else being in there uh, in a in a small in a small place, simply you know being around you when you have the whole place to yourself. That's really the best, especially here in Florida. It's hot, it's humid. At night, it cools down a little bit. I had the air condition going on in inside there. I had my own uh, music going on on the Bluetooth. So obviously, working out at night when just about nobody else is in there is definitely the way to go for me now this is going to be a quick um uh, this is going to be a quick way of me telling you how i felt and all that type of stuff for example yesterday even though i started working out at one o'clock at night i still felt energetic i did not fatigue um honestly i was really surprised that i uh, I, I bench pressed 135 pounds. I know a lot of you are saying 135 pounds for a six foot three dude. That should be nothing. But as you guys know, uh, my right shoulder over here started acting up again. I mean, the whole reason why my bench press has never passed 200 pounds was because of this over here. Uh, however, this time around, I'm working out right. I am being more into the movement being perfect rather than being sloppy, quick and fast and just dropping the weight, having the weight bounce off of you, I am doing perfect form. So if I have to, you know, start out with 135 pounds, so be it, as long as it's perfect form and you are not jeopardizing uh, your shoulder. Now, I felt good, I felt energetic, I didn't fatigue as easily as I did. Um, yesterday, I took my uh, third injection of testosterone uh, 12 hours before I worked out. Uh, that was my third injection of testosterone. And as we all know, it takes about three to four weeks before the um, full benefits of testosterone kick in. Now, testosterone is not a miracle drug. It doesn't make you strong by itself. So if you stay home, it's not going to make you a strong person, right? You have to go to the gym. You have to give it all you got, which is uh, exactly what I did yesterday. Very, very happy with that. So uh, today, uh, it's been, uh, you know, I worked from one, from one at night to about four in the morning. I was doing my workout. I know a lot of you out there are saying, Amr, that's uh, three hours, that's way too long. Let me tell you something. Back in my Hollywood days, man, there were times I'd go like to, to 24 hour fitness and uh, I'd go in, a guy is leaving, it's the end of his shift. And then he comes back, you know, eight hours later in the morning, I'm still there. So uh, yeah, there were days where I'd be in the gym eight, nine hours uh, today. So three hours for me is really nothing at the in the gym. Not to mention that being in the gym is not just an exercise for the body. It's also an exercise for the mind and the soul. As you guys know, as a 40 year old man, I got a lot of things going on in my life. I own my own. Uh, YouTube clone, you can check it out, mgtow.tv, M-G-T-O-W.tv stands for men going their own way, which is basically a movement that's, well, it's not a movement, it's basically a bunch of like-minded men who are sick and tired of this gynocentric feminist world that we are living in, and we basically educate one another and share our I ideas about what's really going on in this crazy world we are in so obviously i just don't have the time to be in the gym eight nine hours a day five six days a week however when i go to the gym now some of my best ideas they come from the gym but i can't be in the gym eight nine hours anymore but uh ideas good ideas come from being in the gym getting your workout done and you want to do it in a timely fashion again i find you know three hours uh good for me the whole eight nine hours like i used to do in the past that's over with 
I would rather go to the gym, maybe. I don't mind going to the gym. I might go to the gym tonight, maybe do biceps. I don't know. But right now, how I feel is that... Here's how I feel, okay? It's been 12 hours since my workout, okay? I had a good night's sleep. I slept for six hours. I came home at like 4.30, 5 o'clock. I slept at 6. I, I, I woke up at noon, which is like 12.30. So I had a good six to six and a half hours of of sleep which is definitely uh, a good amount of sleep to have after a workout so uh i feel good first and foremost here's how i really really have benefited like my chest i feel that my chest kind of like straightened out you know usually a lot of guys out there they, their chest would be like this it'd be like hunched over but after my workout yesterday because if you guys saw how i was doing the bench presses yesterday I had a wide grip uh, bench press. When you do wide grip bench press, it actually extends your chest. It expands your chest. So this is why today I'm walking, you know, taller with my chest out because of the wide grip bench presses I did yesterday. So this is something very, very good because I'm not hunched over or anything like that. A lot of people have that problem. In fact, I'm looking at the guy in front of me right now. He's on his phone and he's like this, you know, he's kind of like, uh, like this, man. Uh, thanks to the workout from yesterday, man. This is how I am, right? This is how I feel right here. I am, uh, my chest is expanded. My neck is straighter. Uh, that's really the way it should go. That's one of the benefits of exercise is that your body kind of straightens up and it expands. Same thing with the back exercise when I do that later in the week. So right now I feel, uh, I don't want to say I feel fatigued. You guys have to remember, I went to the gym, I gave it all I got. That's how you know your muscle is growing when you go to the gym. You give it all you got, you lift heavy. You guys saw me yesterday, I did almost 40 sets that's just the bench press alone that doesn't count the other exercises that i didn't do on video for you so that just shows you that when you go to the gym you give it all you got you know you go down to like maybe two or three reps uh that's when you know that your body is like hey man the muscles are all torn up so right now i don't want to say i feel tired uh, but i do feel uh i do feel fatigued um again haven't worked out 12 hours ago give it all i got yeah of course the next day your body is gonna be fatigued i know my body i guarantee you by the end of the night that's when i'm gonna really really feel sore right now i don't other than feeling a little bit fatigue i don't feel sore in the chest area however i feel it creeping up i guarantee you when i do this video for you tomorrow guys uh, my chest area, my chest, my triceps are going to be totally sore. Uh, I'm, I'm going to let you know about that tomorrow when I do the video for you. So for right now, I feel good. I don't feel, again, I don't want to say I feel tired or groggy. I just feel really, I feel like I'm at peace. You know, I feel like I'm just calm, collected. Honestly, working out is a beautiful, beautiful thing. Again, I can't stress this enough. I know a lot of you guys out there are saying, Omar, three hours working out, that's too long. But I can tell you, even even before this whole TRT thing, again, I've been working out for many, 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 many years. But in the past half year, I didn't go to the gym because obviously of Scamarona, the gyms were closed. Not to mention I was busy with, uh, with, with life. But I can confidently, confidently tell you, gentlemen, that when you go to the gym and you spend time in the gym, it's not just good for your body, it's good for your mind, it's good for your soul. A lot of ideas come into my mind when I'm at the gym, whether it's for this video or videos for my other channel titled Alpha Male Lifestyle Channel or ideas even for my own uh, business ventures. Going to the gym is definitely, 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 guys, a good thing for you. A lot of people get turned off by the whole three-hour thing, but most of those three hours, it's just me listening to my music, walking around. By the way, guys, I don't listen to music when I say I listen to music. I actually listen to... Uh, I listen to uh, MGTOW videos. I don't listen to music because music is really... there's 
music is pointless. You know, you don't benefit from music, but you do benefit from hearing different men talk about different uh, perspectives and different things. So when I say I'm listening to my uh, music, I'm really ta I'm I'm really saying I'm listening to my uh, MGTOW videos. I'm not. I don't listen to music because it's totally a waste at this point in my life. I'd rather benefit from listening to somebody talk about what's going on in this crazy world around us. So when I'm at the gym, the three hours, man, it's not like three hours of me like sitting there uh, getting my butt kicked uh, under the machines or uh, lifting weights. It's most of it really is just me chilling, thinking having a, a spiritual connection if you want to call it that you know karma or whatever right so uh, yeah that's how i feel uh first day after the gym um feel good a little bit uh tired but that's normal because i gave it all i got 12 hours ago had a good night's sleep uh chest is expanded my body i feel i walk up straight uh, when i walk i walk straight my chest is expanded i feel good i'm not hunched over like a notre dame uh hunchback of notre dame a lot of people are hunched over but uh you know if you go to the gym you can always tell when a guy goes to the gym they walk straight up they walk with their uh chest you know expanded i'm looking at the guy right now who obviously goes to the gym i can tell because he does have that he does have uh, his back is well developed so I, you can always tell when a guy goes to the gym and he's giving it all he's got and he's doing it right because of the way he walks you know guys who don't go to the gym you know they walk hunched over they walk like you know like this but guys who go to the gym do their exercise right and actually are getting results of going to the gym they're walking upright they're walking straight their chest are out you can always tell a man who's going to the gym and actually getting proper results all right guys so that's going to be my video for today i will let you know how i feel tomorrow i might even do biceps tonight if i'm if I'm really not tired, I got my coffee. Usually caffeine gives me a kick in the butt. So if the caffeine is able to give me a kick in the butt, I just might as well do biceps uh, at the gym later on, uh, later on tonight. All right, guys, I'll talk to you tomorrow, okay? Bye.